Hey guys, it's Orbstar, and today welcome back to my How to Trade series, and today we're going to be doing it with 20k, and we're going to be doing the Rare Silver Counter Style Method. Before we get into the video, I would appreciate guys and go drop a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate that. Now, I just want to quickly apologise for only uploading one video today, just I've been absolutely slammed with this Romeo and Juliet coursework, uh, controlled assessment, which we're doing this week, so I spent all day, literally seven hours, writing my, dra my draft for it. I'm not sure if any of you guys are doing the Romeo and Juliet this week as well, or did it last week, but it's just an absolute pain and it takes so long. So I've, that's why I just haven't had time to make another video for you guys. So the Silver Counter Style Method, I've used a lot in my Trading to 100k series. If you guys would go check that out for proof, I do encourage you to. It's pretty simple. All you're going to do is put the minimum price of 300 coins, max price I did to 700 coins in this footage, but I now prefer to put it to about 1k, so you can find a few more better deals. Then what we're going to do is we're going to go through all the camera styles, so Marksman, Dead Eye, Catalyst, Shadow, all those kind of uh, camera styles. The best ones have to be Hawk, and the reason I'm not seeing the best ones are Hunter, Catalyst, or Shadow is because you don't really find too many, because Shadow goes for about 2k, Catalyst goes for about 1.5, so it's very rare to find them in those type of camera styles. So if you guys do manage to find them, I do recommend picking them up straight away, especially if they are in a Hunter. So once you guys have done that, you want to go check the cheapest price of a player, especially if you're unsure about them. So for example, Rodriguez. So if you're on a web app, I want to say thank to a subscriber. I believe your name is Hubba Bubba. I do apologise if I got your name wrong, but he's quickly told me a quick tip, which I never knew. If you guys know on a console, you can instantly like compare the price of a player just by clicking A, and there's like an option that says compare price. You can also do that on the web app. I had no idea about it. So you just click on the player, and there's like a button to the right of it that says find all items. If you guys like, for example, is right there, find all items. If you click on that, you can check all of the cards of him on the market. I had no idea about that. So I want to say a quick thank to Hubba Bubba for telling me that. It's just a nice little tip that will help me in the future, and it help you guys as well. Save time by typing the player in. So once you find a cheap spanner price, go check his next cheapest price in that camera style because his cheapest bin might be 400 coins, but the camera style might be going for 500 coins, and it might be another camera style going for 800 coins, which you guys didn't search, which means it might not be too good of a deal. So I do recommend checking the next cheapest in the camera style. So this Rodriguez, he's pretty much the cheapest on the market for 700 coins, and I knew that was a pretty good deal. So an example of this method for you guys is this Jason Puncher, which I went and sold for 2.3k. Now, I think I actually bought him like in a trading video. It was trading to 100k, and I bought him for about 1.3, 1.4k. So that was a really good deal, and that's just one example how you guys can use this method. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Would appreciate you guys could go drop a thumbs up button, subscribe to Harpstar, and I will see you guys in the next video. Yep, see you guys.